State lawmakers will open the new legislative session next Wednesday, but there's tension brewing as House Democrats try to resolve their differences after a change in leadership. House Democrats met behind closed doors for two hours late this afternoon. We agreed to disagree. State Representative Joe Suki formed a coalition to oust House Speaker Calvin Say after the November election. He has the support of House Republicans as well, but many Democrats have expressed concern about how much power the Speaker-elect could give away when appointing committee chairs. There are some questions on the practical aspects of uh, working with Republicans, but I think we're willing to uh, try and work, work through those things and have a unified caucus. It's a good opportunity to air some concerns and some differences. Suki will name Sylvia Luke, Angus McKelvey, and Carl Rhodes as the chairs for finance, consumer protection and commerce, and the judiciary. But it's unclear how many Republicans he'll appoint as vice chairs. We're going to continue what we've been doing as far as uh, uh, honoring the, uh, the, uh, the so-called disagreement with the Republicans. And, we're going to try at the same time bring in the uh, both sides of the Democrats to be more close together. Suki told us after the meeting that he has 25 Democrats still supporting him versus the 18 in support of Marcus Oshiro. That number could bump up to 26 once the governor appoints a new representative from Maui. Lots of movements in politics tonight. Thanks, Kenny.